I'm back to give you guys a reading for my beautiful Pisces. I want to say thank you to all my subscribers, all my new subscribers. Welcome. If you haven't already hit that bell button, hit that bell button at the bottom so you can get a notification each time I upload. So first card out, we have two busy women. Mm, 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 mm. Two busy women. You two busy women. Yeah. Somebody could be getting information, screenshotting you. Mm. So somebody is seeing something. This could be karmic friends. Okay, because I did see karmic friends with shine. Your light irritates their demons. So this could be karmic friends of yours or, you know, people you used to associate with or deal with. They could be watching you shine. They could be watching you winning. Okay. Mm -mm. Yeah. And you over here, I'm <laughs> playing with you. <laughs> As I'm trying to tell y'all what I, what I see with shine your light. Um... Yeah, like everything say demons and karmic friends. I'm like, you know, people you used to associate with, people you know, you don't deal with anymore. And y'all just flew out, said, Mystic Sunflower, but sh <laughs> Not that I'm on page, I'm bald, and let them watch, let them watch. Okay, we have a girl fight in the head. Somebody could be competing with you, want to fight you, or just, it could just, that girl fight could just be a father you want. Somebody was competing with you and they losing. Because you just focused on yourself. You don't even see the competition. Because that's just not where you at with it. <clears throat> you can't win when you're competing with someone else. I feel like the only person you compete with is your old self. So Give me more of this energy, Holy Spirit. Give me more. Please and thank you. I can't. You know, I'm not playing with y'all, son. See? Y'all say you damn right, Mystic So Flower. <laughs> I'm bothered. Um, what's, what is the problem? What is the problem? Too busy winning, unfazed, and unbothered. I cannot make it up. Y'all say, uh-uh. Yeah, somebody just a spiritual hater. Okay, hates on your, your spirituality, your light, your magic, your power. Can be an obsessed lover. Okay. Yeah, we're running. This could have been somebody who you left behind. Who you don't longer deal with anymore. This person is very dangerous, toxic, unhealthy, possessiveness, and a karmic. Oh, yeah. Something about mattress, I'm hearing. Maybe you just got a new mattress. Or you could be throwing out a mattress. Maybe that, you know. Yeah. I just heard mattress. So maybe someone just gotten a new mattress. Or you've been thinking about it. Okay, or you're getting rid of a mattress. Yeah, we have broke ass. Wants a sheep clothing. And threatening. I know somebody is not threatening you. Okay. It says intimidated, threatened, and bothered. So somebody could be throwing, you know, threatening you or... But you're not even paying on no mind. You don't even look at this person's way. Yeah, look at you. You're too busy winning. Okay? Somebody is trying to use their scare tactics, spread rumors. You know, it, it, you're unfazed. You don't care. Somebody looking you up, though. Yeah, whoever the stalk is, they looking you up. Somebody, somebody thinking about the time they spent with you. I don't know who you left behind, but they stalking and watching. They obsessed. They thinking about the time you guys shared, the time that you, you know you spent time with this person. Somebody feel like they missing love, and it's because you're not you're not there. You, you walked away with their running. Mm. Legal issues, child neglect, incarcerated, queen rising. Look how beautiful your energy is. Somebody could be talking about your parenting, or somebody could be trying to get you in trouble, like with 
uh, what is it called child services with this legal issues. Somebody is jealous because you're winning. You're in the spotlight with the idol. Stepping into or or this is or you will be confirmation. So you're already in the spotlight. Stepping into your power of praise, coming up, spotlight, incarcerated. It's given like an eight of swords. Somebody wanna have you bonded. Somebody wanna have you stuck. An eight of swords is stuck, bonded, okay? Legal issues, child neglect. Somebody wants you to be bonded to something. Like they want you to deal with court issues, legal issues, um, possibly in regard to, regards to your children. If this is not this is not you who gone through like some child services situation, this is just someone who's very childish. Okay, um, could possibly dealing with legal issues, and they know they going to jail, so they being childish to try to get back at you because you're you're unbothering your face. This is somebody who who. Knows they going to jail, and it's just like they like like the judge gave them a date. Like you going to jail, I want you to turn yourself in such and such date, and they like, well, well, why I'm out here free? Why I got this little bit of time out here free? I'm gonna make their life a living hell. Like that's what that's what it's giving me. But for others of you guys, somebody is trying to bond you to keep you trapped to a situation in regards to your children. Like I said, I believe it's called child services. Somebody, um, they can't affect. They feel like I right, with the unbothered, you are phase. You too busy winning, you know. They feel like the only way how I can get back at you do the children. Somebody's petty as hell. They know that you don't even you don't even care for them. If it wasn't for these children, you wouldn't even speak to them, even look their way. Somebody knows the only way to get attention out of you is in regards to your children. Okay, somebody else is bitter as hell because they got legal issues. This could possibly to be them being on child support. Maybe they owe you child support. They know they're going to jail. For others of you guys, somebody that is on child support and they're neglecting their child, okay, because they feel like they're you got them trapped up with child support. That so, right, I don't want it to do with the kid. Somebody knows that you're just unbothered, and the only way to get your, your attention, they're using your children. Now that's not going to resonate for any, you know, obviously for someone who doesn't have children, okay. But for the one, if you don't have children, like I said, this is somebody who just knows they're going to jail, whether it's physically or spiritually, okay? And they just trying to be petty towards you because they was trying to get, just like an eight of swords, they was trying to have you bond and attract to a situation. So they, they're at the point where like, hey, I, I don't mind being challenged because I already got some issues, you know, with court, physically or spiritually. They're dealing with some type of karma. Queen rising, love on the brain is stalking you. They're stalking you. Love on the brain. Yeah, but Spirit says same shit, different day. Same shit, different day. Yeah, chasing and always partying. Yeah. I know damn well somebody think you was going to be chasing them. That's always out partying. This, I'm, I'm telling you, there's somebody irresponsible. They don't think like a mature adult. So they use children to try to get at you, you know? Because that's the only way they feel like they can affect you through the children. Yeah, ignoring. Yeah, I'm hearing energy, energy, energy. Be careful who you, how much you giving, how much energy you giving to the situation, because it is giving me like somebody's getting adrenaline, like they get, they loving it. Oh, child, divination, abusing, obsessive lover, and spiritual hater. You can be a reader, or you can do something in divination, but somebody hates on your light, your spirituality, your um your magic and your power. Whoever this person is, the obsessed lover, this is somebody who's very toxic that you got the hell away from. I'm hearing this is played out. Oh, now that's going to be, you know, it's going to be different for everybody. But take your heart and they start see, yeah, spiritual hater again. Divination abuser. If you know, you someone who's very spiritual or you watched, you know, of course you watch tarot reading because you're watching me. Or if you're a reader, okay, this is somebody who's, who talks about you. They gossip about you. But they come and stalk you and watch you, you know? This is somebody who you're ignoring. Yeah, I mean, they do a lot of talking. Now, this doesn't have to necessarily be, you know, a masculine. This could be a karmic that's attached to them. 
because we did see the girl fight earlier. Okay, so I pick it up different scenarios, you know, and it, you know, there's a lot of you guys watching me, so you know, take a part that resonates, you know, and if it doesn't resonate, then it's just not your story. But some of you guys, there's a um, somebody who's attached to this person, they're karmic, okay, and they hate on your spirituality, they someone who's always partying. They don't like you, gossiping about you, all right? Competing with you when you don't even... I mean, you don't even know them. I'm like, who, what? what? <laughs> oh, chef. Give me more Holy Spirit. You guys are humble up there. Yeah, it says, I need time. What's this, I need time, Holy Spirit? Somebody is viewing somebody as just a fling. So they could be viewing the karmic as a fling. And the karmic could be upset with you because they know that this person's in love with you. Okay? And whoever the karmic is, they could be a very obsessed lover. You know, don't want to let this person go. Yeah, secrets and deception. Yeah, they needed time because there was some secret, secrets and deception around surrounding this person. Yeah, awakening, ungrateful, and hidden emotions. Hmm. This person treated you poorly. They didn't appreciate you. This person definitely could be undergoing a spiritual awakening. Okay. This is somebody who hid their emotions from you. Now they want to bring you in a confession. The confession is how loyal you was. Mm -hmm. How they know you was or been a real one. I plan on reaching out to you. Mm. I heard lonely. Who the hell is this? This person. It says fear and I'm intimidated by you. You know, fear is only, you know, the man downstairs. It says I'm intimidated by you. Will you reject me if I had, will you reject me if I had you to marry me? I feel terrible for hurting you. I love you. I know. I'm so, whoever, they, whoever this karmic is that they attach to, they want to fight you. Okay? They could be threatening to put this person on child support. Threatening to throw this person in jail. I mean, like, this is the type of... If you if you be with Mystic Sunflower with Collective Sunset, you ain't going to be able to see this children no more. Okay? This is the type of energy that we're ready to see this person locked up. And, you know, then to watch this person. Because they looking you up. Then to watch this person be with you. Yeah, I feel like I ruined everything. Mm. I need time is what clarify with um, secrets and deception. Yeah, they hiding something. Mm -mm. But they about to confess to you. Mm-hmm. This is somebody who's trying to get away from somebody who got who they got themselves caught up in. Something that was a fling. And, and they must have, you know, playing around, messing around with somebody only to realize this person is really obsessed with them. And they trying to break free from this person. It's like somebody want to come to you right now, but they actually protecting you because they know the person, whoever that person is, it's a lot of drama. What says I need time? Secrets and deception. They regret. They regret having these secrets and, and, and being deceptive. Um, shadow work. I feel like this person is undergoing a spiritual awakening. Mm-hmm. There's somebody who, who who regrets being in a shadow side because whatever they did, we perceived with caution and relationship. This person could have definitely been warned not to deal with that person. What's the shadow word? I heard brown eyes. So somebody got pretty brown eyes. Yeah, surprise. Shadow word clear if I was surprised. They want to surprise you. You are magnetic and I'm so drawn to you. This person is going to pop up and surprise you. But right now, they need time because when I need time and shadow work, this person is undergoing a spiritual awakening. I knew it. 
and they needing to do the shadow work. But why they taking that time? This person is not with nobody right now. Why they taking that time to themselves? The karmic think that this person is with you right now. So they watching you. They looking you up. They stalking you. Your light irritates this person's demons. They even bothering this person. Picking fights with this person. Thinking that confirmation. Damn. I'm about to say, damn, Holy Spirit. Holy Spirit, so you heard that whole They even picking fights with this person. Because they think this person with you. Yeah, rejected soul connection. This person is rejected this person because they know that, yeah, you are the person of my dreams. They have, they, somebody understand that they have an, a deep soul connection, a deep bond with you. This karmic knows that too. Yeah, and look, it said you make me want to be a better person. Yeah, you brighten my world. I love you. It breaks somebody's heart what they did to you. Okay? Some things I need them to say that it breaks somebody's heart what they did to you. <clears throat> but this person is saying they need time. You are magnetic. I'm so drawn to you. This person is gonna surprise you. But they need you, you know they need time right now. They're just working on themselves. They're doing the shadow work. This person is ready to confess. This is somebody who hid their emotions from you. This person knows how loyal you are. They also feel real bad. Somebody feel like you didn't deserve that. I also feel like this person watches you in secret. <clears throat> you don't know about it. Um, if this is not like just physically watching you. This is somebody who's watching you energetically. Okay? But there's a karmic that's attached to them some way, somehow. It's stalking you. Yeah, this person, look, apology and loyalty. Somebody feel bad as hell what they did. Because you was loyal. I find you incredibly attractive. Look, divine feminine mixed emotions. There's somebody who gave you mixed emotions, divine feminine, and they feel bad for what they did. Mm-hmm. I think the world of you, Divine Feminine. But some of you guys, this person have mixed emotions because they don't they feel like you ain't gonna want them no more. Yeah. It says proceed with caution, karma. Mm-hmm. Clingy. Yeah, you got somebody. Ooh, child. Yeah, whoever the hell they were drawn from. Somebody is clingy as hell. Yeah, this was your divine masculine. Your divine masculine is intimidated by y'all. This is the second fear card. You see, your divine masculine thinks the world of you and loves you, but your divine masculine, they fear this connection. They, they intimidate. Oh, confirmation again. Ooh, child. This connection is very intense. I'm hearing I don't want to play no games with you. For some of you guys, this person want to lock you down with a baby. It says, I want you to have my baby. Thinking of the last time we were close. No one makes me feel like you. Abundance. Somebody don't want something to be over. Give me messages on the unfazed. Unfazed. If it's not you, I don't want no one else. Somebody's saying, if it's not you, I don't want no one else. And people know. I'm here, why not? Why not? <laughs> yeah, somebody feel like you're the only one for them. They hide their emotions. Somebody's afraid of this connection. This person is intimidated by you. It says the way you carry yourself is so attracted to me. Somebody loves the way you carry yourself. Yeah. The way you carry yourself is so attracted to me. The love the way you hold it down. Whew. Yeah. Somebody is in a real abusive connection with a karmic violent and confession. They want to confess to you that this person probably would have been, came your way, but 
this karmic wants to fight and do too much. It says I'm working on my relationship with God. Wow. And whoever this karmic is, they envy that. They envy. Somebody feels like, you know, you didn't make you 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 didn't work on bettering yourself for me. What what is it about Mystic Sunflower Collective Sunseeds that make you want to work on yourself and be better? Cause you ain't divine. <laughs> Cause they're not divine sunseeds. They not a divine feminine. They're not a divine masculine. Yeah. They look at this karmic like someone who's dishonest, aggressive. Yeah, it says I gave into some temptation. Who shall? I'm hearing that's crazy. Look at this, sunseeds. Meanwhile, you over here minding your business. I gave into temptation. I'm hearing all my love is for you. This person is over here working on themselves. And this person's trying to, you know what? When I think of when I when I think of the times we shared, I miss you so much. What can I do to make it rain? I'm hearing things you seem to do is so things you seem to do is just so divine. The things you do is so divine. The way you walk the vine, the way you talk the vine, the way you carry yourself the vine, the way you smell is the you the way you smell is the vine, the way you eat is the vine. <laughs> what you drive is the vine. How you smell is the vine. The way you walk is the vine. Everything is the vine. <laughs> this person said, "Our story is not over yet." I love you. Mm-hmm. What y'all gonna do so I see? I'm just a messenger. I plan on reaching out soon. Look, I told you, this is the second time we see the fear card. You made this person want to be a better person. Somebody cannot stand it. I'm hearing everything you do is divine. This comic is very, like, aggressive. They be trying to fight this person. Like, do too much. Yeah, uh, I'm bothered. It's clear if I was destiny is taking us down different paths. So you can you could have decided. You know what? I'm gonna separate myself from this person because you know destiny is taking us down two different paths. You know the type of time they on. I'm not on. I feel like whoever you are, divine, yeah, divine feminine. You focused on yourself. You focused on your bag. You focused on your growth. You focused on your healing. Okay, you focused on your family. You know whatever you you know consider family to you and. You're not going to deal with somebody who gives you mixed emotions, okay? Someone who you was loyal to. Show that you was loyal to. And this is the energy that, this type of energy that will put you to test to see if you see if you a real one, see if you loyal. You showed up to still be loyal. And they turned around and was that secrets and deception? I mean, this, um, secrets and deception still hid from you? That's why, yeah, that's why I hurt this person. And they're dealing with this type of karma. Mm. Give me more unbothered. Finances are a problem. So this person could be going through some type of financial issues at this time. Okay, what's the finances are a problem? Yeah, rejected. Mm. Somebody also gonna feel like karma, um what they going through, this type of karma is because of what they did to you. Mm -hmm. They could be feel like they're receiving karma for what they did to you. So me, I gave it to temptation. Yeah, something was just a flame. And they did all that because they was intimidated by you. Or because this person feels like you're someone who's in the spotlight, stepping into your power, you winning. Um, you know, you get a lot of attention. You know, a lot of people are praising you, a lot of rewards, accolades. And somebody felt like um, being that you weren't um, bothered, you know, by them doing this low vibrational stuff, 
they felt like, okay, you're not since you're not gonna chase me and you know, you're not gonna make me feel important. Like somebody was very childish. They wanted you they wanted you to they wanted your attention and you just wasn't giving it giving it to them, you know, because I give you my attention, but long as it's healthy, you know, you doing right by me, you know, you know, you my lover, of course I'm gonna give you my attention. But son, see, you're not going to give somebody your attention that's out here playing games showing you that they don't respect you. Why would you give in to that type of... Because I heard energy earlier. Why would you give that any energy? You know? Somebody wants your attention, but the way how they did it, it was a major turn off. You was not about to chase nothing. You wasn't about to do that because you know you lure you. You know how you showed up in this connection. That's why somebody is doing the shadow work. I heard Antoine. Somebody's name could be Antoine. I just heard Antoine. Somebody's name could be Pop. I just heard. <clears throat> What's this rejected? Rejected. We got rejected is clarified with. Let me get that. Clear. Somebody could be dealing with somebody that's in the politics. I just somebody could be dealing with somebody in, into politics. Um, we have um uh, rage, but it's in reverse. So rejected is clarified with rage in reverse. Yeah, I don't know when this person rejected you. Maybe this person thought you was gonna be angry or mad. No, you was too busy winning. You was too, that yeah. Proceed with cautious and loyalty. I watch you from a distance. Proceed with cautious and loyalty. Somebody got scared of this loyalty. They got scared? Or they felt like they had to, you know, put their guards up to you? Mm. What's the rage in reverse? Rage in reverse. Ooh. I think the world of you. Yeah, somebody thought you was gonna be angry and mad and because they rejected you, you like no. One sided relationship. You you took it for what it was. That's why this person is saying the way you carry yourself is so attractive to me because you're not about to fight. You're not about to do act out of course you know, I'm sure you know I'm sure it hurted your feelings. I'm sure you spoke about this to this person. You know, um for some of you guys maybe you did it. Um I don't know, but, you know, for what I'm picking up on, I feel like you did speak about how you felt. Um, but I feel like you said it in a calm, you know, a calm manner. You didn't get raised. You didn't, you know, you, that plane is very loud over the house. Like, maybe you were just in your feelings and your emotions the way, you know, you just express yourself. Uh, it was I don't know who the hell they out here dealing with, but somebody is like, <laughs> I'm telling you, you eat the vine, you talk the vine, you look the vine, you dress the vine. It's like, yeah, you got this person in a feeling. Somebody's sick. Somebody is sick. They cannot play. Somebody is sick. They're like, yeah, they're in a feeling. I think the, I think the time, ew, when I think of the times we shared, I miss you so much. What can I do to make it right? Yeah. Mm. Unrequited. I feel your pain, bang, and judgmental. So this person was very judgmental towards you. Gave you unrequited love. And now they feel the same pain that they projected out to you. How they did you. Ace of Cups at the bottom. Five of Pentacles. Somebody wants to come out the cold. Yeah, they in regret. Five, five. Two fives here. Okay. Mm. Somebody's stressed out. They feel better. They feel left out. They feel out in the cold. They in regret. They in regret because they left you out in the cold. Thank you, Spirit. They in regret because they left you out in the cold. Walked away from you. Whoever this emperor is. Knight of Swords. Mm. Somebody mad at themselves. 
Yeah, look at this. Look at this. Somebody mad at themselves. And they want to talk to that. Look, they didn't want to talk to you, Empress. Look at the cards. This person regrets. With this Five of Cups, this person regrets. They are feeling it. They regret giving you unrequited love. They regret judging you. Five of Pentacles, Eight of Cups, this person walked away from you. Maybe because of a party lifestyle they had. Okay? They just wanted to do low vibrational stuff, you know, because they was in their shadow side. Emperor, the, the Knight of Swords. Now somebody want to come rushing back. You know? Eight of Wands to the Empress. They want to talk to you. They want to, that's why that plane was so loud over the house. They want to, somebody want to, yeah, the chariot. Somebody traveling towards you. Mm-hmm. Hoping that they can heal the situation with you. Hoping that things could change between you and them. Yeah. Now somebody is ready to express their hidden emotions for you. This person with the four pinnacles, the high priestess, this person is holding on to you. Mm-hmm. High priestess to the high friend. Wow. Three of wands. Ooh. These are counterparts. High priestess of the... Yeah, that's a yes. Somebody feels like you guys are meant to be together. You're meant to have a life together. That you're part of their future. Look at this. Empress to the... And I can't... Where the emperor at? Where you at, emperor? Where you at? Emperor, empress... That's why it bothers this person so much. Emperor, Empress, High Priestess, the High Friend. One is very traditional, okay? One is very spiritual. Somebody beliefs could be changing, okay? Somebody judged, there was judgmental towards you, okay? When you showed up to be nothing but loyal to them, okay? There's somebody who hid their emotions for you, but they're ready to speak to you with the Eight of Wands. They want to confess now. They want to confess. They hid any emotions. Mm -hmm. Yeah? There's somebody who's holding on tight to you, okay? They want to come towards you. They in a lot of regret, okay? About how they treated you. Mm -mm. Look, the world card to the judgment, to the ace of cups. Somebody want a second chance. They closing out the cycle. The hangman, they had a major realization. Somebody is also afraid of you getting new love. Six of swords to the temperance. Somebody, ooh, eight of pentacles. Whoever this person is that wants a passionate new beginning with you, a fresh new start, this somebody who feels like they need time because they, they this somebody who's doing a shadow, they doing, somebody who's doing a shadow work. Yeah, but the Six of Swords, I feel like you moved away to calm the waters, and somebody's afraid of you finding new love. Uh-huh. Somebody's tripping because they in love with you, and they want a second chance, but they going through this awakening right now. They're closing out cycles that no longer serve them. Yeah. Queen of Pentacles, Five of Swords, the Will of Fortune, Queen of Cups, the Sun card, the King of Cups, Eight of Swords. Listen, mm -mm. I don't know who this person is that's jealous and that's money hungry. Okay. Because mm -hmm. something changed and they ain't damn like that. They ain't see that coming. There's somebody who's a gold digger that wants this person's money, okay? But this person is deciding that, look, they going, somebody going towards the person that they love. Queen of Cups, the sign, King of Cups. Somebody's in love. There's a connection that's faded to happen between you two. Mm-hmm. And whoever this person is, the, the, the Queen of Pentacles, Five of Swords, the Eight of Swords, somebody's trying to bond someone up to keep them stuck. To keep them stuck. Yeah, I didn't even see the Magician here. The Seven of Pentacles. 
and the King of Swords or the Three of Pentacles? Somebody trying to manipulate this person to work with them. And if they don't work with them, with the King of Swords, the Eight of Swords, this is somebody who's saying, I'm, I'm going to get an attorney. I'm going to get an attorney or I'm going to take you to court. Yeah, I'm going to take you to court. You're going to pay me. You're going to give me some money. Ooh, child. You're going to get Three of Pentacles to the Seven of Pentacles. Either you're going to work with me or you're going to deal with legal issues. Mm -hmm. Oh, the shrimp card, the devil, and the ace of pentacles, the six of pentacles. Somebody is obsessed with your investments. Ooh. Somebody is obsessed with your investments. They're obsessed with your wealth. Um, how much you make. Ooh. Yeah, also somebody is, they, they fear you. Somebody's intimidating. You know, this is somebody who's coming in and giving you an offer. Six of Pentacles. This is somebody who's about to surprise you. Somebody knows that. Three of Cups, Four of Swords. There's some type of reconciliation here. I don't know. This was somebody who you somebody was married to? Legally or just living with or what? Somebody is. Ooh, sure. What's the devil part? Somebody wants out of that. They want they want this relationship to be over with. Well, it is over, but somebody, whoever the hell they leave it behind, somebody, ooh. Yeah, the lovers. The devil was playing hard with the lovers. Capricorn, Gemini energy, to a sword, stagnation. What's the lover? This is somebody X. What's the lovers to a sword? Ten of Cups in reverse. Somebody is not happy. They don't feel fulfilled there. And somebody knows that to a swords and they still, with the stagnation, they still trying to keep somebody stuck. They're not happy there. The lover's card. Somebody choose you. They don't want to be there. Yeah, the title card, you a badass. What the Nine of Cups, what the Queen of Wands? Ooh, yeah. Fine business card. Fine, beautiful, ambitious, creative, a go-getter, confident, wishes coming true. You're a badass being full with being filled with um with love, possibilities, a bright path. Somebody, whoever they whoever they leave it behind, somebody is jealous of you. Somebody don't want to see somebody happy. The tower, something is blown. What's the tower? I feel like the tower is a, a powerful change. Something is about to change. What's the tower? Yeah, four cups. Somebody is just, it, it, somebody is bored somewhere. They don't want to be there. It's like, why is you keeping me stuck here? I don't want to be with you. I don't like it here. Ten of cups in reverse. I'm not happy. Who the heck want to be with somebody that's not happy with them? Yeah, six of wands. It's like, what are you doing? It's like, somebody want clout attention for what? The justice card. So you're going to get justice, though. What's the six of wands? Six of cups. Six, six. Somebody wants to go to somebody from their past who they share a spiritual connection with. Yes, two of cups. And this person is trying to make it hard because they know that this person is out. Page of cups. Somebody wants to apologize. Three is towards. Yeah, ten of swords. Everything is fine. This person want to apologize for breaking your heart. Ten of pentacles. Nine of cups. This person wants a family with you. Okay. I'm hearing you not going anywhere. Somebody want to make it official with you. Ten of pentacles to the nine of cups. I'm hearing we ain't getting no younger. Yeah, hermit. Somebody is reflecting. Yeah. They feel like this person is trying to sneak away. I don't feel like they're trying to sneak away. Maybe they maybe they feel like they just ain't telling this person. They, they ain't telling this person all their business because they know that this person ain't dealing with a full deck. Somebody, somebody is ready to be happy. They're bored where they at. They don't want to be there. Somebody's still trying to, yeah, 
forewarned. Somebody, somebody trying to keep somebody stuck and they want to reconcile somewhere else where they want to build a family at. Somebody who they share a spiritual connection with. Somebody is slowing down with the 6-6, six, six, slowing down with the hermit, reflecting. Somebody realizes that you guys share a very spiritual connection. They want to reconcile with you. King of Wands, we just seen the Queen of Wands. How many... You guys are a perfect match. Four wands to the page of wands. This person wants to message you. This person is going to surprise you with some type of celebration or offer or, or commitment. Um, some type of proposal. Yeah. For others of you guys, it's like whoever this this this, this, this somebody could be very childish or somebody who they shit a child with. It's like there's a lot of fight and argument in this house. The page of ones to the four ones, that's five of ones. It's like all this fighting and this arguing. I don't want to be here. You keep trying to get me to stay here. Ten of cups in reverse. You know I'm not happy. You know I'm I'm I'm, I'm where I'm going. I'm going to somebody. He they know. Somebody's trying to make that for it's hard. They're trying to make it hard. Ooh, sure. And so I see, even if you decide you you not gonna take this person there, you know you you that's your free will. I'm just the messenger, but somebody knows that it's over, and they know that this person is coming towards you or guys, you know you don't want to confess to you, and somebody just feeling some type of way. Yeah, Knight of Wands to the Nine of Pentacles. I'm telling you, this person is single. Okay. Confirmation. You heard that horny are single. And I'm telling you, they fighting with somebody to get <laughs> somebody like, why is I fighting with you and I'm already single? Why? Two of wands. I'm trying to leave. Two of wands, nine of wands. I'm trying to go about my business. Okay? I'm trying to go about my business. Why is I fighting you and I'm single? Jeez. Somebody realized Two of Pentacles, Page of Pentacles, Seven of Swords, whoever they was teaming with, whoever they was working with, this person is a snake. Yeah, the Justice card to the Ace of Swords. I'm telling you, somebody that's a damn true spirit is saying. Yeah. The skills are about to be balanced out. Nine of Swords, Queen of Swords. Hmm. Somebody worried. Nine of Wands. Yeah, a chapter is over with. Somebody is worried about something ending. Somebody is going on a merry way. Ooh, Somebody want to know, who is you? Like, who, who is that? Who is that girl? Who is that guy? So they went looking you up and found out you was a part of the mystic sunflower. Sunsea tribe. Oh, you divine, 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 divine. <laughs> they went looking you up, Sunsea. They found out you was part of the Mystic Sunflower Sunsea tribe. Oh, you divine, divine. Yeah, no fake, fake. That's that real. <laughs> well, Sunseeds. You know, this, you know. For some of you guys, I know, you know, it wasn't a funny matter when, you know, when you was going through all of this, but I'm phased, I'm bothered. Listen, you got to breathe. Sometimes you got to breathe some humanity. You got to laugh, okay? Laugh is good for the soul. Laugh is healing. Laugh and keep you looking young, okay? Stress-free. <laughs> Period. Let's get you guys some signs, so I see. Let me see. I guess you guys are supposed to cook this. Yeah, somebody is worried. Somebody needs to caution themselves. Somebody could be calling 911. I'm looking down here over my phone, but it's 911. Something could be an emergency. Somebody could be calling the cops on this person. Trying to get this person arrested. Something could be a restraining order as well. It says the solution you seek may come from an unexpected source. Ooh. The solution you seek may come from an unexpected source. So Spirit is saying whatever the solution is that you're seeking is going to come from an unexpected source. Okay. 
could just be from this reading. It could be a confirmation. Confirmation. <laughs> I just had a spirit verb, but the numbers are 422, 27, 33, 37, 56. Um, 22 and 33, you can be seeing those numbers, a lot of twos and threes. Um, again, it's 422, 27, 33, 37, 56. Um, five and six breaking down to 11. So you're about to awaken to something. Um, uh, listen to your intuition. Three and seven breaking down to a 10. So something is ending. Three, three. Your angels are around you. You're being guided at this time. Two and seven breaking down to a nine. So a cycle is wrapping up. Two, two, you're on the right path. Four, you are divinely guided and protected. Um, I just love numerology. So, trust your intuition, okay? A cycle is wrapping up. Somebody, um, somebody could be, uh, I don't know, like I said, you have free will to do what you want, but somebody is wrapping up a cycle that feels like they're being guided to come back towards you, okay? <clears throat> The solution you may seek is going to come from an unexpected source. I feel like you're on the right path. Your angels are definitely supporting you at this time. You're being divinely guided. Yeah, I feel like you're wrapping up cycles that no longer serve you anymore. Five or six with 11 listen to your in, um listen to your intuition okay you're definitely awakening to something just know as, uh, as well with the number 11 the universe has your back okay first card out is we have capricorn energy holy spirit give me more signs we have pisces energy give me more signs we have libra holy spirit any more signs Ooh, we got taurus any more signs on spirit? Okay, we have Leo. Give me one more, Holy Spirit. One more. And we have Scorpio with Virgo under the bottom. Okay. This can be any of your signs, yours, theirs, anybody who's involved. Sun, Moon, Rising, or Venus. Okay.